so TikTok and Reels are yesterday's news, and the new thing is OnlyFans, the subscription-based app that gives you access to exclusive content from your favorite artists. And Puerto Rican single no singer Noelia is just one of the celebrities to be joining in on the fun. That's right, because during an interview, the 40-year-old star said that after canceling her tour due to COVID-19, she opened an account on the popular app better known for adult-only content. And in the past two months, listen to this, she has earned $285,000 in two months, what? guys, in two months. That's right. It's also worth noting that in 2018, Noelia accepted an offer to produce pornographic films. So although as of now, she is only using OnlyFans to share sexy but not pornographic content, it may be something that, you know, can probably happen along the future. As so. of now, right. Uh, yeah, as of now, exactly. Right. Now I want to ask all of you, my Latin Xers here, have you guys used OnlyFans? Did you guys know what it is? Who would you like to see and would you pay for it? <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna start here. I wanna talk about Noelia first because she had a porn video leaked a couple of years ago, many years ago, and then she's used to posting this racy, racy, racy pics on Instagram, so she might as well make some money off of it, so that's good for her, I guess. Uh, it was bound to happen, so if OnlyFans existed before, she probably would have done it before, and if I would use it, I knew about it, but I haven't used it, and I would only use it if I had, like, John Mayer exclusive content, but, like, singing or stuff. I don't want no porny stuff, like, ah, we don't need that, or or whatever I want to see like that exclusive content that I would pay for him and then that's it yeah. maybe I'll check it out <laughs> no I feel you I get it and you know I kind of see Noelia the same way with Bella Thorne Bella Thorne also has it and you know we all know we used to see Bella Thorne on IG posting always very provocative very XXX type of things and they would even take some of her stuff down so why not and I agree with Alex that why not, you know, do this and get paid for it since, you know, Instagram doesn't even want it. I will say that I uh, I didn't know about Oling fans until this quarantine that it came out and I started seeing other people, Cardi B and stuff, joining it. So I was like, oh, okay. But now I'm, I'm noticing that more and more it's, it's going away from the, the, adult kind of world XXX and it's kind of going more to like art hey there's some housewives that are now on OnlyFans. So yeah, on. but trust me, OnlyFans is really maintaining, you know, itself because of, you know, the the triple X, the pornographic material. Let's not kid ourselves. Do you have to put pornographic stuff there? No, no but is it mostly that? Yes. You know, you mentioned Cardi oh. B on there and you mentioned obviously we've already talked about Bella Thorne and uh, you know and of course no, uh, you know Noelia so I, I got to wondering, like, how much does this cost, right? Because they talk about how much they're making, but how much does it cost That's each true. user? So here's this. Cardi B charges $4.99 a month. That's not bad. Right? That's a $4.99 yeah. subscription. Okay. Bella Thorne charges $20 a Ooh, month. Yeah, $20 a month. Expensive. And by the way, Bella Thorne revealed that in less than a week since opening her OnlyFans account, she has made... Two million dollars. <laughs> so wow. that's sort of twenty dollars. You know, two million dollars. So that means she has over a hundred thousand subscribers there. And that's not taken into account, of course, what OnlyFans like their percentage. You know, like the company itself. Okay, that's but crazy. what about Noelia? Noelia, believe it or not, charges more than Cardi B and Bella Thorne. Actually, more than them combined, because what? Noelia charges. $34.99 a month. No way. But listen, if you guys think that's too expensive, you can pay for the full year total, and it comes out at a discounted rate of $315. <laughs> <Discount>. <laughs> Christian, you have a lot of information about OnlyFans. I just want to throw that out there, okay? I have a lot of information about everything, Alex. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just saying. Myself, because I have all ideas of traffic. Really, if you'd have Bella Thorne, okay? I would have never known. I, I'm, but honestly, I wouldn't pay. For, I would ever use. You guys know that I'm like here, so like even. Claudia, Claudia, I have to tell you something, Clau. You must be yeah. wasting all your money on OnlyFans because your Wi-Fi is out, girl. So, <laughs> <laughs> it's breaking out, girl. You must be wasting your money. <laughs> 
shit your shit is breaking up. Ay, Dios. Pero bueno. You know what? About OnlyFans, I think it, this is kind of like a two-edged sword because maybe you get into it and you really like it and stuff, but then you don't never know who's on the other side. You might be making money, but then it's getting too risky. I don't know. I think I would never be there, but I would never say never because everyone has a price. Like, if they would give me $10 million, maybe I will put a little video, but I don't Who know. Who wouldn't? Of course. <laughs> now that you're... And, and back now that you're no, saying go, go. never say never, it's making me think of Justin Bieber, which I'm thinking that's Claudia's response to who she would pay for. So, yeah. you're problem with it. I'm going to kill it. I'm going to kill it. I'm going to kill it. Okay. Let me translate. <laughs> Let me translate for Claudia. She's basically saying, I love Justin Bieber. I probably wouldn't pay for that because he's on IG. But yeah, she loves Justin Bieber, right? That's what you said, Clau, right? What about, what about the rest of you? Nas, Alix? Who, who, would you, who would you want to see on OnlyFans? Who would you pay on OnlyFans? Well, I, I already said one. I already said John Mayer. Right. But honestly, I would have a big list if you give me like five seconds. So, Nas, you go first and then I'll go. I'll okay. Going with my I, I think I would also join Claudia in her interpretation of I don't think I would pay for an OnlyFans. I, I wouldn't. I would pay maybe for somebody who's going to teach me like, you know, makeup class or like a hairstyle or somebody that gives me like horoscopes. You know what? Like a Walter Mercado. I would have paid for Walter Mercado to be like, mucho, mucho amor, Nastasha Scorpio. What? Yes. No, Nas. <laughs> you have to give me a little spice. I got my man for that, Alex. I got my man for oh, that. Yeah. Christian, He's what about watching. you? Christian. For free. Uh -huh. <laughs> Alex, what about you? What, what's that list? No, okay, so maybe Trevor Noah too, Chris Hemsworth, Liam Hemsworth, Brad Pitt. Um, oh, oh, yeah, I okay. think I would pay. Calm down. Calm <laughs> Your down. Your salary gets there. Man, <laughs> calm down. <laughs> All right. What I, about I, would you, say, I would say I'm just going to give one, and it's Jennifer That's Aniston. Dasha? Oh. Jennifer Aniston. <laughs> she doesn't need the money, but if she ever had an OnlyFans, trust me, I'd be right there. All right, guys, that's it. No? Yeah. All right. Yeah, I'm I guess just so. you know, if anyone knows Jen Aniston, please just. <laughs> So can I, if I show this, can I get $2 million? You know, people show feet. People, there you go. People show feet. Then I'm saving it for my I would show my account. feet. I would show my feet. Okay. No, Ali. 25 okay. cents. That's 25 cents. Here's a Ustedes ya saben que acá en Latinx Now les tenemos todos los news de absolutamente todos los artistas Latinxers y los que no también. That's right. Osuna, Bad Bunny, Anuel, hasta Sofía Vergara makes an appearance every once in a while. Quieren estar súper enterados de todos ellos y más. Ya saben, suscríbanse. That's it. Subscribe. Go now, por favor. Bye.